the angles so far, so we'll stick with that. So rotate one. Okay. Toe hold doesn't get used a lot. I don't know why. It's nasty. It works really well. I like it a lot. I've won a lot of fights with it. Um, people don't practice it very much, so I, you know, it, it's usually a lot easier to get somebody with than, than other ones. Um, I think it's just as nasty as a heel hook because it pretty much fights all the same areas and you've got more control on it. So I've got two hands on his foot rather than just basically one, okay? So with the toe hold, what I want to do is I'm looking at his toes, okay? If I can't see his toes, like the tops of his toes, I can't toe hold him. I don't want to see any of this, okay? Nothing annoys me more than when I see somebody going like this, why isn't it working, Derek? Or this, okay? And I always walk over and I say, can you see the top, or can you see the knuckles on his toes? No? Okay, you're, you're not doing a toe hold then. So you always have to be looking at the top of his foot, okay? That's an easy way to remember. Usually I remember he's facing me, I'm facing him, I can hit a toe hold. But if I'm just looking at his foot, well, I can see the knuckles, all right, I can toe hold him. Grab his toes, okay? Traditionally, you'll see people do this, and there's a, a wide variety of grips that you can do on this. They're all great. This is the meanest. This one works the best, okay? I can say that unequivocally. Squeeze his toes, all right? Doesn't feel very good, does it? Not enough to make him tap out, but it hurts. Grab his toes, reach around, and grab your own wrist, okay? Right now, I'm being very nice. I'm not really putting it on. All I have to do is turn it like the wheel of a, a car, okay? Pull his toes, and then pull up on his ankle, okay? If he flips over, go ahead and flip it down. There you go. If he flips over and I'm here, I turn in and I try and put his toes into his butt, okay? So I'm, I can control his foot very easily until he kicks it out of my hands. I don't care which way he goes. I'm just going to follow him and keep turning him around until I can finish it, okay? Okay? Good. Sorry, pants left. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> Um, again, a lot of people think that they could last it because if they have had one done to them, they have the one where the guy grabs the side like this and just kind of torques. And this is most, mostly a push, a pushing down on the top of his foot. And if I really get into it, I can get him to tap, right? But it's, it's not as easy as this, okay? So most guys are like, I'm tough, I can handle this, he's not going to get me. And then you switch to this one and then they're screwed. You know, you can literally break a guy's ankle with this. I've done it. It's not a very nice sound. So in, in practice. No kidding, guys. Yeah, he has, really. Um, it wasn't in practice when I did it. It was in an in a MMA fight. But don't be a tough guy in practice, OK? Tap when it hurts. Got it? Good? 